I don't suppose you've got any neuropazine you can spare, do you? No, I'm sorry, I don't. It was worth a shot anyway. A word of advice? You might want to keep a low profile tonight. Golem City can be sketchy in the best of times. This definitely isn't one of them. Why? What's happened? Haven't you heard? Terrorists try to blow up Razika Station. And even though people here couldn't have had anything to do with it, the cops need someone to blame. Where I come from, cops are supposed to be the good guys. What planet is that? Because where I come from, the police have been militarizing for years, wasting money and inciting deep levels of mistrust between them and the very people they're supposed to protect. Is that what's happening in Gollum City? It's happening all over the place. The cops in Gollum are a special breed. They control everything here. Food, drugs, neuropathy. And not all of them think very highly of us odds. These cops, they're looking for members of Ark? We're all members of Ark to them, one way or another. And some of us may have even done bad things, but not the kind of things the rest of the world says we've done. Sounds like you support Ark. Why shouldn't I? The Augmented Rights Coalition was started with the best of intentions, as a non-violent way to confront injustices and advance the cause of Augmented Rights. Okay. But in my experience, the best of intentions often go awry. That may be true, but right now Talus Rucker and Ark are the only things keeping people in Golem alive. Trust me, they're the good guys. I'm getting the impression that you see Ark and Talus Rucker as some kind of augmented Robin Hoods. How well do you know the man? I met Talus years ago in India. We were both humanitarian aid volunteers back then. Is he a good man? The press paints him as a narcissist. He has his faults, but I wouldn't believe everything you see on Pakis News. Does he visit this area of the complex much? He... You know, you've been asking me an awful lot of questions. It's just that I heard Rucker didn't get augmented voluntarily. So I'm wondering how that kind of experience colors a man's perspective around people who did. Talus was always passionate about the ability of neuro-augmentations to heal people's bodies and souls. His accident only strengthened his beliefs. Is he still an idealist then? After everything that's happened? Listen to his daily broadcasts. He believes people will usually do the right thing in time. They just need to discover what the right thing is. I see. Well, thanks for the warning, Doc. I hope you'll take it to heart. Fucking can't feel my toes, man. My neuroprosthetic junction is screaming. I need drugs! Don't you know what that is like? Huh? Huh? Oh. Oh.